ladies and gentlemen, the Commander-in-Chief of the Atlantic Fleet, Admiral Kelso. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. It's a great pleasure for us in the Navy and Tidewater to share this evening with the, these magnificent young musicians. I wanted very much to do two things this evening, uh, to let you hear what our musicians do all over the world on a daily basis for you and for our country. And I wanted uh, very much uh, for them to see how much that you appreciate them, because I wanted to relate a few things to you that you may not know. I guess I didn't really appreciate our musicians in the military until I went to be the commander of the Sixth Fleet. And what I found there was that uh, every day they could have played seven or eight times if we'd have had enough musicians throughout the Mediterranean because the music they play is the music of the world. And they did some wonderful things. On the 4th of July, you could see them marching down the streets of Cannes. Every year I was invited to the Winter Carnival in Nice, France, but really what they wanted was our band. Uh, I understood that, and that was fine with me. One particular day, I remember uh, they were playing for an audience in a country, I won't mention the name, but the political persuasion was not always in our favor, and there was a crowd of about 5,000 people listening to them play. And the heckler started to get pretty bad, and the bandmaster was a bright young fellow, and he played the national anthem of that country, and then he played the Stars and Stripes, and the crowd ran the hecklers off. And so they are great ambassadors throughout this world, and when I was in Washington on my last tour, we were favored by our Navy band for many concerts, and I could see no reason why we can't do that in Tidewater. So it's a great pleasure tonight to share this evening with the Navy League. I'd like to thank Kurt Hamacher for his outstanding support, and I hope this will not only be the first, but one of many more for Tidewater. The next part of this program is the climax of our show, our way of commemorating 213 years of dedicated service by Navy people around the world. This script was written by Master Chief Journalist Larry Luther, and the music was arranged by Chief Musicians David Ward and Ralph Martino. Our narrator needs no introduction tonight. He is well known throughout Hampton Roads. It is such an honor to have him here that we will even overlook the fact that he served in the Army instead of the Navy. Without any further delays, I want to wish the Navy happy birthday and turn the stage over to Jim Kincaid and the bands. Please enjoy the presentation and thank you for being here to help us celebrate our birthday. God bless you all.